Welcome to another episode of Hardcap Basics. In this episode, we'll be looking at Asset Audit using the Location Using Barcode function. The Audit by Location feature allows a user to preset location, cost center, and person before scanning an asset's barcode. With these three pieces of information set, when the user scans the barcode, the asset's attributes will automatically be updated. Asset audit by location has many benefits to your organization. It includes efficiency gains as well as reduced time to complete an audit. One of the main benefits of audit by location is having preset the location, cost center, and person, although in the audit by location function, cost center and person can be turned off. By having this information preset, all an auditor needs to do is scan a barcode and review the subsequent information without having to constantly check and update the location information. With that being said, they'll still need to change the location, cost center, and person where appropriate. If using order by location and you have cost center and person enabled, cost center and person will still have to be populated. All right, let's have a look at order by location in action. So first of all, because I have location, cost center, and person enabled, I have to set values for location, cost center, and person. I can now scan a barcode. With this barcode scan, the system has returned to me that it's an IBM ThinkPad Pentium 2 366 laptop. From here, the auditor now needs to review the subsequent tabs to ensure all the information is true and correct and update any information that may need updating. So we can go on Asset 2, double check the condition. Maybe the condition of the asset has changed. So from there, we can change it to be in good condition. We can take new photos if necessary. We can update the GPS coordinates. We could review and update more text if necessary. If the asset was associated to preset questions, we can review the preset questions as well as update them if necessary. Once all the information has been reviewed, the user can now press the save button. With the save button now pressed, the user is automatically taken back to the assets tab ready to scan the next barcode. Thank you for watching this episode of Hardcap Basics. If you have any questions about anything you've seen in this episode, please don't hesitate to contact Hardcat Support at support at hardcat.com. Thank you very much.